What's up you guys? I hope you're having a great day. In today's video, I want to talk about something that we are all bound to experience from one point in time to another. And that's the feeling of not knowing what we are doing. In life, there's always going to be times where we don't know what we're doing. And these times may feel very unsettling. They might feel intimidating. And sometimes they even feel downright frightening. They shiver us to the bones and just paralyze us with fear, make us not want to do anything. But it is in these times when, when you don't know what you're doing, the uncertainty that is actually one of life's greatest gifts to us. You see, in these times of the unknown and uncertainty, we're on the brink of discovery. That's right. You're about to forge a new path for yourself. You're about to venture out into the unknown and go beyond your comfort zone. It's in these moments that, that you face uncertainty, that you learn the most, that you grow the most, and you ultimately end up achieving the most in these situations. So guys, the next time you're feeling like you don't know what you're doing, right? Think about all the inventors, creators, pioneers, all the people that once came before us. Do you think they had all the answers? Do you think they knew what they were doing? Think about somebody like Thomas Edison who created the light bulb. Do you think he had a plan or um, a map of exactly how to create this light bulb? Definitely not. Or think about somebody like maybe the Wright brothers. Do you think they were given an instruction manual on how to fly a plane? No, they were not. It took these people stepping outside of their comfort zone, right? It took them forging a new path, taking on risk and uncertainty and going down a path that nobody else would do. And by them doing that, they became historic. They became great and they achieved basically the impossible. Now, something else that I really want to, to speak about is not knowing what you're doing doesn't show that you're weak. It's not a sign of weakness. It's actually quite the opposite. In fact, not knowing what you're doing and being able to admit that is a true source of strength. It, it shows your strength. You are extremely strong if you're able to, to vocalize that you don't know what you're doing and <laughs> try, to, try to look out for help, try to reach out for help, try to research and figure out what to do uh, in these times of uncertainty. Now, yes, it's, it's scary and it's intimidating, right? But it's ultimately in these times that you're going to be able to learn, grow, and become something that you never thought possible. So pat yourself on the back. Give yourself a big hug because you are strong and you're going to get through this tough time. Now, guys, whether you're starting a new job or maybe learning a new skill or dealing with personal issues, right? This stuff can be very frightening. It can paralyze you with fear because it's all new. It's uncertain and it, you don't know what you're going to experience, right? But if you can shift your focus just a little bit and take these uncertain times and, and take it as an opportunity, an opportunity to grow, an opportunity to become something that you are not, and an opportunity to become greater than you ever thought possible, then you will be able to find the courage to, to go forward, to put one step or one foot in front of the other and keep pushing forward every single day. Yes, this is gonna be unknown territory to you. Yes, this is gonna be maybe unknown territory to a lot of people, but you know what is best for you and you know what you are trying to accomplish. And only you know that. So I fully encourage you to embrace these times that you don't know what you're doing. These times where you or loved ones and friends may not have the answers for you because it's in these times that you are really going to evolve and turn yourself into something great. Just remember that every expert was once a beginner. Every master was once an apprentice and everybody who has ever achieved greatness stood exactly where you are standing right now exactly where I'm standing, where both of us have been standing. And it's okay. In fact, like I said earlier in this video, it's great. Embrace this time, embrace this moment and be happy that you're feeling this way. It is in this time right now that 
you are going to be something that you never thought possible. So guys, I hope that this was able to encourage you in some sort of way. I hope that you take this feeling and fly with it. <laughs> Go do something with this feeling. This feeling is amazing. This feeling is great. And you are honestly so blessed. You are working so hard. Your hard work is not going unnoticed. You are exactly where you are supposed to be in life. You're doing great things. You are exploring yourself, learning about yourself. And guys, trust me, even though it feels like it's scary and it's unknown, you are exactly where you are supposed to be. So guys, I love you so much. I hope this was motivational. Take care, be safe. Go do something with this amazing feeling that you're having and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.